Hey guys, this is me, Daniel Hutchins, and today we are bringing back Talks with Dan. Yes, Talks with Dan. So I know you guys probably don't really fucking care about Talks with Dan, but yet I'm still going to be doing Talks with Dan anyway. So if you don't like Talks with Dan, don't watch the video. But if you don't mind it, keep watching. Okay, so I'm just going to make this pretty clear to y'all. Um... My weekend was pretty good, and I mean, mom and my dad just basically screwed off the whole weekend, doing their own fucking thing, and then when I got dropped off from my friend's dad, um, I had to literally weigh the box in the street and take two trips or three trips just to get all my shit in the house. And then next thing you know. My mom and my dad are like. Why do I have all these mugs? Why do I have all these cups? Why do I have all these shirts? Why do I have protein drinks? Why do I have comic books? Why do I have this? It's like what the fuck guys. Like what the fuck. Can I just get a simple. Hey you're back. Or hey I was glad to see you. Or something but no my parents had to be like all inquisitive and curious and wonder all wonder why I had all this shit but then so now I'm finally back down in the Dan cave I haven't posted a video on the Dan cave for two days and yet here I am now yay I'm back but anyway yeah but anyway beside that I want to tell you that my weekend was pretty good, but then now, now with daylight saving time ending, and all the times all fucked up again, and the night time is coming quicker than say that of days that happened before. Not like it doesn't really fucking matter though. But again, I just want to let you guys know my weekend was pretty good until I got home, and then when I got home. They wanted to know if I spent all my money, and I'm like, yeah, I spent my money. And then they say, and then my mom wanted to be a fucking smart aleck and be like saying, then my mom wanted to be a fucking smart aleck and be a fucking bitch to me and say, say, oh, you didn't even say thank you for the money. I'm like, do I have to say I'm thank you every time I get money? It's like, fuck. But then it's like, you know, <sighs> two of the meals I got for free. Without having to lift a single piece of money, all the rest of the stuff I have was either given to me, 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 given to me or I bought myself. But majority of it was all food or comic books, which are my two go-to expenses. Now, if I had a third expense, it would be movies, but again, with the times we are in with the corona fucking virus... And stuff. I didn't see no movies. So this time no movies. But I got cups. Mugs. Comic books. Drinks. And food. Yes. That's all I had. But anyway. If you guys are so fucking curious. As to what type of comic books I bought this weekend. I. Actually bought myself. Three more Detective Comic Batmans. Now I'm not going to show them to you. Because I'm still kind of pissed off at my mom and my dad right now. And I'm just trying to relax right now. I'm trying to readjust back to being home again. And yet they still want to be fucking bitches and fucking assholes. And be like saying, why do you get it? It's like, fuck that. So it's like, no. Now I'm down here doing talks with Dan. on For you guys on my YouTube. And for all you viewers and subscribers and shit. It's like, you know, okay. But then, the three Batman books are Detective Comics numbers 617, 618, and 619. Again, I'm not showing them to you because uh, it's not really much to show. Just that they're Batman books. And I also got three new Batman cups. Two of which are similar to the set. One of a similar offset. Then I also have a Spider-Man mug. I just got myself protein shakes. And I got myself... A Mexican Coke. And a new wall decoration for my man cave. 
So again, like I said, not a whole lot. Also, I was trying to ask them if they were simply watching NASCAR all fucking day. And they're like, no, we were actually all around. And it's like, oh, right, okay, sure. You say that you were all on around shit. But it's like, really? Really? I don't really believe you really, really did really anything anyway, guys. So all I can see was that simply you guys are just being lazy on the fucking couch upstairs in the living room and just doing nothing but screwing off on your cell phones and watching NASCAR. That's what kind of was what my parents are doing. But then yet they say that they had bought a new RV, which was ten fucking thousand dollars, and they got a new Chevy truck. Um, so, you know, I'm not even going to fucking see those in person until Tuesday or Wednesday. And that's because they didn't sign the paperwork, nor did they bring it home. So then when my friend's dad dropped me off, they're saying, Hey, where's the truck? Where's the RV? Well, simple. It wasn't there yet. So it's like, you know, my friend's dad didn't know that at the time, though. I just told them that they said they had just made two big, big, my parents had made some big ass purchases. So, okay, it's like, alright, yeah, fine, whatever. So then, now I'm not going to be able to see this big ass motor house and this new truck until Tuesday or Wednesday. Because their fucking lazy asses didn't sign the fucking lease and didn't sign the paperwork saying that they now have them now. <sighs> not like it really doesn't fucking matter anyway. Plus, tomorrow is going to be a fucking hell of a day anyway, because I'm not going to, I'm probably not even going to be able to go to Bell this week, because my mom hasn't even fucking, fucking even got off her fucking fat ass and even called the fucking people at Bell and said, hey, can I have Daniel back at the Bell Socialization Center? And they're like, no. She didn't even do that. She didn't do that in the entire time I was at my friend's house. So that's her dumb fault. But again, like I said, um, yeah. Again, her dumb fault. Again, so like I said, if I don't go back into Bell as soon as fucking possible, I'm not going to have a slot. I'm not going to have a spot. And if I don't have a spot, then I can't hang out with my buddies. And if I don't have my buddies, then I don't have a social life. And if I don't have a social life, I'm stuck with my fucking, fucking retarded asshole ass wipe douchebag school friends on Facebook Messenger and I don't want to have to deal my whole entire life with them I want to actually have other people I can assort, assort with and associate so again I know this talks of Dan has been pretty negative as of lately but again like I said I've just thought that I was going to come home and be welcomed and not have my mom and my dad be smart ass bitches. But again, they wanted to be smart ass bitches. So that's their problem because I clearly didn't know. I just walked in the door. Then next thing you know, they ambushed me with all these fucking questions saying, where'd you get this? Why'd you get this? Blah, 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 blah. Like, shut the fuck up. I just got home. But then again, it's like, you know, oh my God. Parents, mom and dad, I fucking hate them sometimes. They just, they always like are saying, Oh, we have too many mugs. And you get any more mugs and you're going to have to throw ones away. I'm like, fuck you, dad. I'm not having to throw away nothing. I'm not going to throw away my coffee mugs. Because first off, that's wasteful. Second off, why the fuck would I even want to throw my coffee mugs? When they actually have a fucking purpose. One, drinking. Two, storage. Again, like I said, my parents are both fucking stupid. But again, that's not my fault. That's their fault. Again, it's their fault they're stupid. Not me. Also, so yeah, anyway. I You were probably thinking that I was going to be talking about Cosmic Universe. And that's where you guys are wrong. Because right now I'm not feeling like I'm talking about Comic Universe tonight. Just because of how stupid my parents decided to be when I got home in the door. Right when I walk in the door, my parents started being fucking bitches to me again. And I'm like, no, I don't want to want to be around you guys when you're being fucking bitches. So that's why now I'm down in my room doing Toxic Dan. 
Again, not every talks with Dan is going to be a negative talks with Dan, but this is just happens to be one of those times it is a negative talks with Dan. Okay, so since I'm not in the mood to talk about comic book universe right now, I am going to wait maybe a couple days or maybe several days, depending <laughs> how long it takes for me to cool down after, you know, my parents being fucking stupid. I might be doing some comic book universe, maybe near the later part of the week instead of right away. Because I know even though I told you guys I was going to do Comic Book Universe when I got home from my friend. Now I don't want to do any Comic Book Universe right when I got home from my friend. Because I need to actually have some time for me to actually fucking relax for a fucking change. Also, so again, I'm not going to do Comic Book Universe until maybe Wednesday. So, if you guys have a fucking problem with it, then... You're just going to have to suck it up, Buttercup, because that's when I'm going to probably now going to be doing my comic book universe. So again, this is Daniel Hutchins, your host, with Talks of Dan of 11-7-21. So again, I'm not going to do comic book universe tonight. I'm not going to be doing it Tuesday. I'm not doing it Monday. Fuck those days. Fuck Sundays. Fuck Mondays. Fuck Tuesdays. I'm going to be doing Comic Book Universe on Wednesday, Thursdays, Fridays, and weekends. That way, I can minimize the amount of content that I stream and minimize the amount of times I run my mouth for you guys to be entertained based on all you guys who want to know more about Comic Book Universe. So, this is it, guys. I'm not going to be doing Comic Book Universe today, tomorrow, or the next day. So, I'm going to be doing Comic Book Universe on Wednesday. I repeat, I'll be doing Comic Book Universe on Wednesday. Okay, so, I'm just going to try to chillax, drink my drink that I got from Wendy's. Just kind of screw off, trying to relax. And I'll let you guys know when I am... You guys will find out when I'm back again, because you know that the times on the bottom of each video tell you when I was active the last time. So, again, I'll see you guys later. I gotta relax. I gotta fucking cool off now. So, see you and then see you on Wednesday. Bye.